I don't worry about anything. I just, I just ride, man. You know, I like to do what makes me happy. I like to do what I think works for me. I don't just stick to a thing like you're saying, like just straight you know, square box, this is what we do, this is when we do it, and this is how we do it. Like, I try to keep it a bit spontaneous because, it, and it's funny because my dad used to say it all the time, muscle confusion, kind of confuse yourself, you know, put yourself in positions that you're not always in. Kind of makes sense, you know, you have to have, in my opinion, a little bit of both. Like, you have to have some, you have to have rigidity, you have to have, like, a routine, but, um, but it's good to get, like, out of, the, the, out of your zone, you know what I mean? Um, and I, that's helped me in racing, like just a mindset where I'm uncomfortable here, but we're doing it. You know, we're this is this is the job. So it's put me in a mindset where I don't worry about anything. I just I just ride, man. So the mountain biking, that's cool. I got more, I got into that when I got to SoCal. I've always liked to run and stuff, and I've always liked to. I, I love combat sports. I've always boxed. I've always kickboxed that kind of stuff. Basically, just everything that's fun that gets my cardio like to the next level. I'm doing. Justin's an old soul. That's what that's how he is. I mean, he's just he's into so many different things. You know, motocross and supercross isn't everything to him. It's something that he loves and he loves to do, but it's not everything that he talks about. When he's not riding, he really doesn't talk about supercross and motocross. He loves music. He loves working on cars. You know, we love riding um, street bikes, and he'll work on street bikes. And you know, he's just one of those guys. He's just he's all rounded, and I think that's what makes him. He's a little bit different from a lot of guys. He's a very smart kid. He knows what um, what he wants in life, and um, you know I knew he was going to win the championship because you know that's what he wanted to do. And I'm I'm excited about the future. I think he's on a solid team, and everything's just matching up perfectly now. Uh, the W is a, a place where uh, where I kind of grew up, so to speak. Like I moved down here when I was 17 from Oregon, and um, you know met met Johnny, met some people here, and uh, this place is where I just sort of I went, oh, okay, cool. I I recognize this. Like this is the one thing here that I that I totally can can deal with. Yeah, it's all light, man. It's all it's all light. It's all fun. We keep it keep it light and don't stress a lot of stuff. We just look things kind of straight up and down and we go, yeah, that will be fine. You know, even if things go this way or this way, we do take it a little bit lightly. Some people might call it, call it sloppy, but I, I think it's necessary for me, just the person that I am. Johnny sort of like raised me in a way, <laughs> like when I got here. These days we, we, have, we have a way better understanding with each other these days than ever. This was like the thing I called home kind of right away and then I was, I was sort of gone here and there, like just team stuff and kind of some mix-ups and things with uh, with who I was riding for, different companies, and it's all it always sucks too because I would have liked to have been here the whole time, but uh, I've been here for the majority, so it's like you know it's all good. Um, but this, yeah, this place is like my my second home. Uh, Johnny's been really good to me. You know, we we have fun together. We we think things pre we think pretty alike when it comes to what, what it really takes and we keep it really fun, it's, it's cool. Um, you know, it's, it's, it's fun to kind of get back here and do something a little bit different. <laughs>